Okay, today is February 16th. We are working in the greenhouse again. Today our project is to install the uh, irrigation system in the greenhouse, the overhead sprinklers. So we worked on this a bit last weekend and uh, ran out of time, so we're gonna finish it this weekend. So over on the east side here, you can see along the ribbon board, we have installed a half inch poly tubing and that comes up on each of the rafter supports. We're securing it with uh, zip ties. And then, up here on the top, there is a small tube that, an eighth inch tube or a quarter inch tube that comes off of the half inch line with a little sprinkler head on it. And we're doing it in two halves. So we have the east half of the greenhouse on one system and the west half will be on another system. On each half we have the uh, rafter supports which are these cross pieces here that are on every other rafter. So for instance this rafter has a rafter support, this one does not, this one does have a rafter support. So on each rafter that has a rafter support, we're bringing up the overhead line from a T from the ribbon board, and we're coming up and it just dead ends up there, so we just fold it back on itself and tie that off. That makes a watertight seal. And then we put in two of the overhead sprinklers on each overhead line. And with our initial tests, we found that we have complete coverage on the ground area when we do that. So uh, here we are on the south side of the greenhouse and we plan to have just a little bit of a walkway over here but uh, with the sprinklers up there which are eight feet away it covers all the, the soil down here. So that should work out pretty good. So today we have just a little bit to finish on the east half system and then we're going to work on the west half system. So. Uh, we have that going and also, let me get a little bit closer over here, where we have the ribbon board. This uh, this here is the ribbon board and then we have our half inch poly tubing going along the ribbon board. We have a place here that is a, a flush spot and we will just put a piece of tubing down here and, and just fold it off to make the seal on that so, so it's not running out. But we'll be able to open that up to flush the lines and then we have a valve that controls the flow going up to each of the overhead runs so we'll be able to control each sprinkler pair individually that way and depending on how much water pressure we have uh, right now we're just running from a pump so we probably won't have a lot of water pressure so we'll have to do one or two of these small zones at a time uh, in the future Probably a year from now we'll be hooked up to the Bear Butte Valley Water Project and we'll have full pressured water system and we'll probably be able to do the entire greenhouse I'm suspecting or if not we'll be able to do at least half of it. So uh, here's as far as we got last week. So our tubing is still kind of laying down on the ground. It's not all tied up all the way. So uh, that's where we're going to continue this week. <laughs> 